Hello and welcome. Today we are going to discuss how customers by using VMware's project Serengeti with EMC Greenplum's GPHD distribution and EMC Isilon Scaleout NAS enterprises can not only store big data but also leverage shared infrastructure to reduce time to insight while keeping and making Hadoop simple, flexible, scalable, and reliable in their environments. So let's take a look at my vSphere environment where I have deployed Serengeti and I will be using Serengeti server for the remainder of this demo. So here I'm going to log into my Serengeti server via SSH. I am also going to get into the Serengeti command shell and I'm going to issue one command, the cluster create command. It takes in a spec file as its input and that specifies what actions Serengeti takes in order to create a Hadoop cluster in this demo environment. So my spec file in this case had asked Serengeti to create a cluster using EMC's Greenplum HD distribution as the compute layer and EMC's Isilon Scaleout NAS as the shared storage layer. Not only is Serengeti providing me with detailed status on all my components in my Hadoop compute cluster, but it is also provisioning and configuring these components to bring my Hadoop compute cluster online. As soon as I see service ready, I know my cluster is available and online. So let's list my cluster to see what Serengeti created for us. The status on the cluster is uh, running, which means my cluster is online and available, which is great. The distribution on my cluster is green plum HD as expected, and it's using Isilon Scaleout NAS as shared storage. I have one job tracker, four trust trackers, and a client, and they are all using shared infrastructure. If I was to list out the details of my compute cluster, I would see that these are all the components and their corresponding IP addresses. Now let's see how easy it is to scale compute in this Hadoop compute cluster. I only have four task trackers and I want to add more. This time around let's uh, go into this Serengeti shell and issue a resize command. Once again one command, no spec file this time around and just changed my Hadoop task tracker number from 4 to 8. Serengeti, as expected, is now provisioning four new VMs as my task trackers and configuring them. Serengeti just allowed me to make my Hadoop compute cluster extremely elastic as I used one command to double my task trackers in this Hadoop compute environment. Once again, service ready means my cluster has been resized. We just saw how easy it was to scale the compute layer in my demo environment using Serengeti. Now let's take a look at how easy it is to scale the storage layer for this demo environment using Isilon's Scaleout NAS platform. Now let's go to my Hadoop client and do a DFS admin report. We will see that we only have 19.4 terabytes of capacity for my Hadoop compute cluster. In order to scale the Isilon cluster, I have a freshly installed Isilon node available for this demo. I am going to log in to the console of this freshly installed Isilon node and I'm going to hit enter. Once I hit enter I get a list of clusters that are available for this node to join. I'm going to select rx-hdfs or number 4. As soon as I do that the cluster then goes ahead and adds the node into it. This newly added capacity is immediately available to an Isilon cluster. Let's go into the DFS admin report again from our Hadoop client and see what the cluster capacity is. We will see that this cluster is now 24.3 terabytes in size and so the additional capacity is immediately available to your Hadoop cluster. At this point I would like to conclude my demo. As we saw VMware Serengeti makes deploying EMC's Greenplum HD distribution with Isilon's Scaleout NAS extremely simple, flexible, efficient, and reliable in enterprise Hadoop environments today. 
Thank you very much, and feel free to ask us any questions at this time.